हेलो स्टूडेंट्स हियर वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट मेट्रो ऑप्टिकल नेटवर्क सो द मेट्रो नेटवर्क कैन बी ब्रोकन अप इन टू टू पार्ट द फर्स्ट पार्ट इज अ मेट्रो एक्सेस नेटवर्क एंड द एक्सटेंडेड फ्रॉम द कैरियर सेंटर ऑफिस टू द कैरियर कस्टमर लोकेशन सर्वाइविंग टू द कलेक्ट ट्रैफिक फ्रॉम दैम इन टू द कैरियर्स नेटवर्क सो द सेकेंड पार्ट ऑफ दिस नेटवर्क इज अ मेट्रो इंटर ऑफिस नेटवर्क इज द पार्ट ऑफ द नेटवर्क बिटवीन द कैरियर सेंट्रल ऑफिस सो द एक्सेस नेटवर्क टू द टिपिकली कंसिस्ट ऑफ रिंग ऑफ फ्यू किलोमीटर्स टू अ फ्यू टेंस ऑफ किलोमीटर्स इन डायामीटर एंड ट्रैफिक इज प्राइमरली हब इन टू द सेंट्रल ऑफिस सो द इंटर ऑफिस नेटवर्क टेंड टू बी several to a few tens of kilometer between site and traffic tends to be more distributed so uh, the capacity growth is driving the deployment of wdm and this network so the metro carries a need to provide a variety of different types of connections to their customers so this service mix include uh, the private line services as uh, tactical multiplexing types of various services uh, such as ip based services ethernet based services uh, gigabit ethernet based services fast ethernet based services or fiber channel so another factor is that the traffic distribution changes much more rapidly in metro network than in long haul networks so this drives need to be able to rearrange network capacity quickly and eff efficiently as needed based on the demand and the reconfigurable wdm wavelength division multiplexing network allow capacity to be provided as needed in an efficient manner so a driver of wdm de deployment in metro networks has been the need for large enterprise to interconnect their data centers so this data center are separated by several kilometers to few tens of kilometers and all transactions are uh, mirrored at the both side so they can utilize the uh, at the data center of the uh, both side so there may be other reason have the separate data center such as a low real estate cost at one location than the other locations uh this kind of uh, scenario is generated so there has been widespread development of private wdm link for enterprise applications for metro networks a uh, router or atm as synchronous transfer mode switch can connect into a dwdm dense wavelength division multiplexing transport network by mapping packets or in case of atm consider as a atm cells directly on to a wavelength without the intervening use of sonnet or sdh or tdm so the effect of tdm can be replaced with the optical dwdm which can increase bandwidth utilization uh, facilitate networking and also reduce the cost so dwdm can uh, complementarily element the need of extra fiber which is a specifically significant for providers who have fiber uh, exclusion problem and it can easily coexist with the sonnet and sdh network or with the older fiber terminals operating on asynchronous protocols so dwdm has already revolutionized the, the telecommunication industry by providing the infrastructure for long haul optical network so they provide uh, a better approach for that connections so in the case of metro optical network uh, they provide 1 to 40 uh, gbps per optical wavelength and range is less than 1000 uh, km provided by optical uh, metro network or metro optical network 